In the last 19 seasons, no one has destroyed our stage and blamed it on science more than our next guest. Please welcome back our science guy, Steve Spangler. Three, two, one. Watch this. This is hot water. So if you take some of this liquid nitrogen and pour it into the hot water, I want you to see the little cloud that we make. Okay. Ready? Okay. Oh. So, no, dump the whole thing in. Okay. That's fine. See how that works? Yes. Here, see, so watch this. See, so, see, so isn't that kind of cool how that just kind of goes everywhere? Yes, it's very so cool. That's kind of fun. All right. Mm -hmm. So this is like hot, uh, this is liquid nitrogen going into hot water and we're creating this little cloud that's here. I was just thinking if we did it over here that was bigger, that would be more fun. Yes, all right? it would so, be. So come over with me, let's just do this, all right? All right, so come on over here. Now, this is a bigger tub, so this is gonna hold about, tw no, it's okay, you can come over. Because you, you got your glasses, I mean, you're fine, all right? So that's what I'm you said when I had the glasses on. <laughs> Okay. You know what, I think that I've never actually really done this before, so um, it might be a really good idea. You stand behind the um, shield. I, that's okay? what I th was right, thinking. So this, is, uh, this is the liquid nitrogen. So we need about uh, 20 liters or so of the liquid nitrogen, okay? Yep. All right, so this is, um, let's just see what that looks like. Oh, we need more, all right? Now, the directions call for about a liter and a half. But I was just kind of thinking that this would be good. All right, so I think that'll be perfect. All right? All right, so now, here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna come back here with you. All right, so, all right, so here's the deal. Uh, I'm gonna pour the hot water into the liquid nitrogen and then you'll just see a, a little cloud up here. Okay. Okay? All right, see you later. <laughs> all right, here we go, you ready? All right, here we go. Three, two, one. I know you've always wondered, how does an airplane fly? Yep. <laughs> Who has it? So, uh, so, so the secret is Bernoulli's principle. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, and the best way to show that is with toilet paper. So now, watch this. If you want the air, uh, the airplane to fly or the toilet paper to shoot up in the air, you would think that you just blow underneath <sighs> like that and see how it shoots up in the air. Yes. But check this out. If you blow over the top. Bernoulli said that fast moving air creates low pressure. It'll lift it up like this. Okay, here, watch this. See, you just did it. <sighs> yeah. Is that awesome? Yeah. <sighs> did not know that. Well, that's pretty much all I got. Okay. So, uh, <laughs> I've been on 15 times wow. and this is. This is your best one yet. That's Thanks. great. Oh, here, I've got this. So, here, I was thinking with a hair dryer here, you can hold it like this here. So, okay. just hold on. And now, check this out. Watch this fast moving air creates an area of low pressure. Isn't that kind of cool? Yep. So, you can kind of reel it out a little bit like this, too. And there you have it. It's, it's pretty much that's yep. what I got. Right. But then I was thinking if you could just make it bigger. So, this is great because when you TP at home, it takes so long to do it. Oh. And if you could do it fast and yes, leave, so much better. And the police don't show. Yes. All right, so so watch this. So you just take a paint roller and you uh, kind of roll it out this way. Okay. So I'm going to give you this, uh -huh. and so all you have to do is turn that on uh -huh. and just kind of aim it there. Uh, perfect. Yeah, that's a really good one. Check this one out. This is good. Here, try this one. Let me do that side. I did this one, right? There you go. See, you gotta get the really cheap stuff, yeah. all right? And it has to be thin. So come on over this way, take Alrighty. a look at this. All right. Um, there are 60 rolls of toilet paper here hooked up to 60 leaf blowers. And I think Daniel Bernoulli, who died in the 1700s, would be proud. Yes. All right? Yes. Because when you flip the switch, they're all gonna go at once. Okay. All right? Which, and here, I have this it's switch right here. Expensive. Right, so this is yours. TP. Right? Yes. Yep. No, no. But you don't have to worry about it. We, at the very end, are gonna roll it all back up. Oh, we are. <laughs> We're gonna get it right back to the Holiday Inn where we took it. Oh, all okay, right? Great. So that's. Uh, and there's no toilet paper in this audience. Uh, all right. They, they know as well. Okay, you ready for this? Yes. Okay, kind of help me with this. I'm gonna do a three, two, one, and then you just kind of flip it on. Fast moving air creates low pressure. Bam. Ready? Here we go. Three. Two, one, flip it on.
ultimate party trick. You're gonna be awesome at this, okay? Okay, okay so here's what you're gonna need to do. You get three glasses. You know what the rule is. You don't try this at home, you try this at a friend's home, <laughs> right? So this goes here, so you need some water. So here are the glasses, you need a little bit of water in each one, and then on top of that goes, see? <gasps> now it's, it's just food coloring. <laughs> All right, so on top of that goes a tray. So okay. you get a tray, like from, I don't know, uh, fast food place, and then you go like this. Okay, perfect. Now, you're gonna need to have these. What do you call these? Uh, toilet paper rolls. We call them doo-doo-doo -do -do tubes. Okay. So, doo -do -do, that's how mom knew they were done. So, so that goes here like that, and then this goes here, and then this goes here, and now, what do you call these? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Oranges. Okay. All right, so uh, this goes, so here's this, and then this goes here, and this is the ultimate tribute to Isaac Newton. Got it? So here's what you're gonna do. In just a second, you're gonna smash the tray. And when you hit the tray, it's gonna cause the forward motion to hit the toilet paper rolls, knock them out of the way. The, the little uh, oranges will sit there. Gravity smacks them right into the glass. You're gonna be great at this, okay? Okay. Okay, so watch, stand over here. Mm -hmm. So um, what you're gonna do is this. You're, ha you're right-handed, right? Yep. Oh, thank God. So here, you're like this. You're gonna pull back about like this, and then you're gonna hit the tray, but don't knock over the glasses. So object. Don't knock over the glasses, but you're gonna boom, kind of smack it. Okay. Got it? Yep. This is gonna be so good. So All you're right. gonna be about this far back, and then you go boom, and you're gonna hit it, okay? Yep. If it works, three in. Got yep. it? Okay. Drum roll, please. Come on. Three, two, one, hit it in. And the crowd! That was awesome. Three in. I love that. So, um, if you take Alka-Seltzer and you drop Alka-Seltzer into water, you get this... <laughs> this is not like war or anything, well, no, this so is fine. Everyone's is... covered in here. I know something's gonna happen. No, it's, it's fine. They gave Tony an umbrella. I know no, something's it's happening. Fine. <laughs> Please hold on to the glass of water. Okay. So if you take a glass of water and you just drop Alka-Seltzer, for example, into the glass of water, you get this great bubbling reaction. Mm -hmm. And it's actually a great way to be able to teach chemistry because it's, uh, it's creating carbon dioxide. Uh -huh. So if you could trap that carbon dioxide, Totally fun, uh -huh. all right? So here's what I want you to do. This is an antique. It's called a film canister. Uh -huh. um, <laughs> a long time ago, they used to have film in a, in a camera. I've read about it. Yes, uh, and so here's what you do. You put a little bit of water, it's a classic. You put a little water in the film canister, and then you drop the Alka-Seltzer tablet in, and then you just put the lid on. So you and I are gonna do this together. I'll be the lid person. Okay. You're gonna be the Alka-Seltzer person, okay? Okay. So these have a little bit of water in them, and here's your Alka-Seltzer tablets. Okay. And so you're gonna start from How over many Alka-Seltzer am I putting just in? Just one. Oh, so just one. So put one on, and okay. then, yeah, and now I'm gonna put the lid on. Okay. okay. Now you do the same thing again. You're gonna wanna go pretty fast. Okay. Keep going, keep going, good. Keep going, good. Oh, wrong one, okay, yeah. sorry. So good here, like this, and this one's here. So, oh, sorry. So there's a little bit of, yeah, don't worry about that, it's fine. So what's fun is you turn them upside down like this, where you see, 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 is that awesome? Yeah. Yeah. But that took us a lot of work, because it was fast, mm -hmm. so, my good friend, a guy by the name of Science Bob, said, if you, if you take the Alka-Seltzer tablet and you glue it to the top here like this, then you put the water down below, and then you can turn it over, and it's like a time bomb. So here's what I did. I just put magnets on them like this, and so now watch. Um, I've got 50 of them here, so, all right? So now it's ready to go. Isn't that awesome? Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, so now, this is where you come in. You're gonna hold on to this. No, and... I'm not. <laughs> No. Of all these times no. I've been on, this is a no, I'm no, not. No, I'm not. It's fine. I, I am. All right. All right. So, so watch this. So you turn it over like this, and you see there's a reaction going on in here. Right. No, it's fine. It's fine. And, and sometimes you'll see just a little fizzing going on, uh -huh. and sometimes you can hear it like a little bit of popping, mm -hmm. but you can hear the fizzing kind of ha taking place inside. Sometimes it takes longer than, than others, <laughs> yep. but you'll see a little Sometimes pop. it takes This is, yeah, yes. So, so this, is, this is where I see, it's like a time delay. It's just like a... A time reaction. That's fun. Yeah. I'm oh, sorry, sorry. My eye! Sorry, sorry. Sorry. You okay? Yeah. Okay. That's dumb. A lot of people uh, work was, here, you know? That was not very smart. All right. And, but, uh, but, All right. but then I was thinking, if you could do this in a classroom and make it bigger, it'd be fun. So if you don't mind, come here and take a look at this. Yeah. Right? Just be careful of oh, this. Oh, I see it already. So. So here's what I have. And if, yes, put that on, please. So, so this is what this is gonna look like. 
There are 3,000 film canisters under here, all prepared with Alka-Seltzer tablets. Have you tested this? Never. No, seriously, have you no, tested it? No, no. We did 200 in rehearsal. And this uh, is how many? 3,000. Because you always say, go big, right? I, I do. If you're gonna get kids excited about science, yep. this is how you're gonna do it. Okay. So here's what you and I are gonna do. We're gonna start with this one, we're gonna tip it over, then we're gonna tip this one over, and then we're gonna stand here and enjoy. All right. Got it? Yep. All right, come, come what over What about here. these people? No, what they're fine, they're All fine. Right. All right. These are fine. These are fine. All right, you ready? Yeah. All right, so you get on this end over uh -huh. here. We're gonna just flip it over, ready? One, two, three, flip it over. Good, good. Okay, now come over here with me. All right, flip this over. Okay, here it goes. All right, good. Nice. All right, now, now, this is what's good about this, uh -huh. is that these are just gonna, oopsie, we should do this. We should, we should do this. 